I'm Jennifer Morris for Howdini.com. If you've considered Botox but decided it's not for you, you might want to know about face yoga. It's a system of stretching and working face muscles, which is supposed to help reduce wrinkles. To demonstrate is Annalise Hagen. She's a yoga instructor and the author of The Yoga Face. What causes the muscles in the neck and uh, chin to sag with age? Several factors, one being not enough exercise. Just like any other muscle, it's going to get flabby if it's not worked. Secondly, we have genetics. Some people are just blessed with that certain genetic propensity. Um, and then also adipose tissue begins to stop being produced as much as fat in the face and the neck. So believe it or not, the thing that many people try to avoid is actually really good for face and neck. But these exercises help to stimulate the production of collagen and elastin also, which tones the muscles under the skin. Okay, now what exercises do you recommend to keep this firm so we don't have to wear a lot of turtlenecks. And... Right, okay, well one, you're gonna be working this platysmus muscle right here, which is a huge muscle. So if you think of just pulling a gym carry, mm -hmm. like kind of jutting out your chin, yeah. All right, and you can smile, yeah. And you'll feel like a nice constriction happening here. And then just let it go. This is one of my favorites, it's called Kiss the Ceiling, and literally you just stick your chin up and really try to plaster a wet one up on the ceiling. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. Really pucker up, stretch those lips. Mm -hmm. It's also good for the lips. There's a variant on that called the baby bird that I like. It's a little more difficult. What you're going to do is take the tip of the tongue to the roof of the mouth, smile, and swallow. And you're going to do it at several different angles. So first I'll do it to the right. I'm going to tip my chin up, tip of the tongue to the roof of the mouth, smile and swallow. Right, and you can really feel those chin and neck muscles mm -hmm. working. And then you know you do it to the other direction. Tip of the tongue, roof of the mouth, smile and swallow. Do you do these as a series in order to work, mm -hmm. or can you? I'll do a couple to each direction and one or two in the center. Um, there's a traditional yoga practice. Um, it's called a mudra, where you're sealing in energy. And traditionally in yoga, we finish practice by going into a pose called fish. Mm -hmm. And it's traditional to slide the lower teeth over the upper teeth. So it's a similar action, working again the neckline and the chin. And it's probably important to keep the rest of your face mm -hmm. relaxed. As always with everything. Can this reverse damage that we've already done? It can definitely tone and lift. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Jennifer Morris for Howdini.com.